As a way to be more environmentally friendly, the State Department of Transportation is now using recycled plastics to help repair our roads. KITV4's Jefferson Tyler has the details. Conservation continues to be a key here in the islands. The old mixture for asphalt was less than 40%. Now they're looking at a mixture more than 50%. The big goal here is to help Mother Earth. The path to a cleaner environment in Hawaii just may become clearer if a new pilot program proves to be successful. New asphalt composed of a higher percentage of recyclable waste is being laid out over Fort Weaver Road in Eva Beach. First impressions, good stuff. It looks like asphalt, smells like asphalt, compacts like asphalt. It's post-industrial plastic that is uh, shredded and pelletized into small little black pellets. Two mixtures will be tested, one from recyclables from the mainland, the second from plastics from Hawaii. Plastic from marine debris taken out of our ocean could be recycled into our roads here or local post-consumer waste could also be recycled into the roads to increase um, and enhance the performance of the roads. This higher percentage mixture has been used previously in India and in California. We're not starting from zero because everybody's already moved forward on it, but the research shows that we can build this pavement to last us that 20 to 30 years that we want and be, um, be inert enough to ensure that we don't impact our environment. HBU and UH will be performing tests on this roadway to make sure it does the same or better than previous asphalt and does not negatively affect the environment. It also may add jobs to the area. We're looking at setting up a plant here to ensure that we can convert our plastic waste into pellets to ensure that we can use our trash to build our new roads. They'll be testing this pavement for the next year to make sure that it works and that everything works according to plan. And then there are hope that this may come to other parts of the island. Jefferson Tyler, KITV4 Island News.